Hey guys, this is all streamed at back with another episode of MLB 19 the show road to the show This is our starting pitcher and Let's go ahead and uh, let's get into some games. I Think what we are going to do is we're going to do the pitch type sequence mem uh, memory We haven't done this before. I don't know what to expect Okay, in this session you'll be shown a pitching sequence you will need to recreate. Remember the pitches used to help you mix up speeds during a live game. Oh, that was the change up, right. Fire, ice, ice. Okay, we had ice, ice cracked, fire. Oh, okay. Yeah, right, right, right. Okay, I had it the wrong way. There we go. Okay, I know what I'm doing wrong. And that one, yeah, I completely missed. Fire was... Oh. Okay, I completely missed that, so... That had me all shook. We did get bronze, though, so we at least got something. Um, I know what I was doing wrong. Um, the, the way that I was looking at it was the one that was on top, which was fire, was the triangle, but it was actually the X. So everything else, I, I just had those two mixed up, the top and the bottom. But uh, next time I do that one, I'll get it. Okay, and we're going to talk with uh, Tim Peterson, uh, give him some words of encouragement about his recent slump. You're an important part of this clubhouse. We're all behind you. And he appreciates our support. Well, this guy certainly okay, so here we are. Loves pitching at home. Take a look at against the rubber duckies against the rubber ducks again. This time we are at home. Than he is on the road. Mike Burris is in the so we will see if we can have a better game than the last one against them. Okay, that's a bit outside. We got that one. Hey, that fastball must have a little late life on it because that was right in the wheelhouse and he still wasn't mm, even a little low. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. I think he's shown you right there. He was trying to put you away with the And we got that. There's a strikeout. That'll keep you on all stuff. Fastballs and the off speed. And now we'll look at the starting lineup for the visitors in this one. Mark DeRosa, what do they have to do to get the season off to a good start on the road? Matty, this lineup is built Okay, let's see if we can get two cool outs the here. They have amazing speed up and down the lineup. I don't I don't even think the third base coach gives a steal sign. I think So our confidence is already line. up. So be on the lookout for that today. Fastball swung on and grounded out towards second. And he'll whip this one over to first and he gets his man. And I don't know how the confidence is up that quick, but um stepping up now. I'm okay with it. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. I didn't think we did that great in the last game. Bases are empty here with two men out. 
This one's down to third. There we go. Is there. Throw on to first gets him and the side is retired. Nine so pitches. Happening here in the top half of the first. So it's on to the bottom of inning number. Hey, come on now. Here we go. Leading off the inning, David Hernandez. And they'll need him to get something going here. End inning in nine pitches or less without allowing a run. So we can run our pitch count up to 18 and still be fine. Ooh. It's the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. Man, when you're struggling at the plate, that pitcher smells blood in the water. There we go. Coming right after you, so far, so court. good. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. All right, here's how the home side's lining up defensively. And when you talk about third one base, you, you talk about a step in a dive. So let's but keep it going. To go with it when you get to your knees. And that's what this guy has. An absolute howitzer. Omar Feliz comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Lifted the other way out to left center. And there we go. Davis calls off the left fielder as he takes charge for the So we've act. got four pitches to use on Maxwell Castillo. Now at the plate, Maxwell Castillo. He'll get to take his first cuts here. All right. And this one runs up high, ball one. Two out, nobody on. Ball and a strike. Two that pitches left. Was a lively one. You could hear the pop of the glove all the way up here. Yeah, nothing better, huh, guys? I guess. All right, so that. we have to end I'm it here. As partial to that as most people. He looks good and loose out there to start this one. Oh. Again, he sends it out of play. Hey, I don't mind you throwing a fastball in this situation, but I think strike him out with an off speed. That one caught a little. Bit I know too right where we're gonna go. Put him away. Give me your best stuff. Here you go. Now another one, two. Mm. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Okay, that's fine because that's a foul. And foul, though it had the home. So we can distance. still do it right here. Ooh. And that fades down and okay, away. he two. almost swung at that. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying to get the chase hey, right there. Now. He's been fouling everything off. He's still got the entire arsenal open to him, so we'll see. And there we go. Next. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. And now it'll kick around in the corner. Well, that's still only 21 pitches. Boy, there's another opposite base hit right there, Dero. It's he's turning a April showers into May Fowlers <laughs> right now. There's no doubt about it. This guy has gotten off to a start. But it's his so let's just try to get field. That's what's made the difference. Try to get the out here. We're trying to push everything the other way. He's taking what's All right. given him. A swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. Two down now. There we go. Fastball swung out and missed, and the side is retired. One hit, one left. Striding in, Benny so Adams we are up by one. Part yesterday afternoon as he cashed in with three hits in a losing effort. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. It's one and one. Ooh. Okay. I'll take it. And he should hopefully have that. Nope, no one's got it. But he won't get to it, and this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. Around second, he's on his way to third. And he is okay. Nobody's out. Triple. Other than a home run, there aren't a whole lot of better ways to start an inning than a triple. So we are up by one. He's getting one run in this inning now. Yep, Just off the outside, and it's one and zero. Oh. But I would like. In there, one to uh, one. not give up a run here. Here's the one one. To one and two. That brought him to his knee. Runner at third here, nobody out. And this is lifted high in the air down the right field line. And no one will track it down. No outs, no outs. Working we got him. Punch out and the offering. 
Fastball called strike three, and there's the first down of the inning. No doubt about that, that was a strike. Into the box now, Mike Burris, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run. We have our strikeout already. We don't walk people, we really don't. Here's the first pitch to him. Right there for strike one. Adams takes his lead at third with one away. Okay, there we go. Foul. Mm. Again, another foul ball. All right. They're calling for all these fastballs, and I kind of want to throw breaking balls and off speeds. Hey, I'm biased to the hitter right now. Keep frustrating that pitcher. Foul 12 of these things off. He's going to miss over the heart of the plate at some point. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Challenge canceled. Why? I didn't allow a walk. Is an E5, and I bet he'd like to have that one over. Now batting. Stepping up to the plate, Carlos Mendoza. He got Ooh. on top of one and was okay. a down victim last time. Strike one to start the at bat. Comes set with the 0 and 1. Outside for a ball, 1 and 1. Yeah, we got one. Runners are at the corners with one man out. 0 oh and 2. Or er, 1 and 2. Catches the outer half. With two strikes and the runners at the corners, this is a big pitch coming up. Got it. Nice. To hope to either get a strikeout or a double play ball to help you get out of this. That was a good so curve. Up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Carlos Mendoza is out number two go, here in the go. third inning. First pitch of the ad. So we've thrown a lot of pitches this inning. That was a good curve. In for a called strike. Line yep, we got it. Field. Davis is there and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out of it. And we are still up so by one. The cleanup hitter, David Hernandez, he'll lead things off here in this one run contest. And okay, our energy is about halfway gone. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0-2. I think it's safe to say he wasn't ready for the fastball. Yeah, and they set him up with that curveball on Ooh. the pitch before, and that one, they just blew right by him. And they could go either way. Let's try now, to throw this one a little high. Home. Okay. And he wastes a fastball high That's fine. And there's your That's really what I wanted right to do. Get the eye level up. Let's see if he comes back with another fastball elevated or drops a hammer off. There we go. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. One gone. So that fastball that missed high, I was hoping now he would swing. Omar Feliz. Hey, he, he flew out in his last at bat. Okay. On and missed its 0 and 1. I'm surprised we're seeing so many late swings on fastballs. If there's one rule of thumb in the game, get to the heater. That looked like a good swing, actually. Hey, come on, Just now, looked a little going. high. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. This guy has been throwing the ball so well, and that's exactly why. He has such a feel for that secondary pitch. He can flip it over whenever he wants. Okay, 0-2. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. The there we go. We dropped a curve. And that's the second out. Coming to the plate now, Maxwell Castillo. He reached on a single in his first try. Hmm. Ball one as the changeup misses well off the inside. Okay, if nothing else, that might back him up a bit. Allowing us to get that without even a swing. Okay, one and two. Ball and two strikes to count. You pull a fastball like that, you got to tell yourself to slow it down a little bit, play more gap to gap, and mm. keep that front shoulder square pointed towards the pitcher. That'll keep everything on plane. Two down now. 
Okay. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. He executed that one-two curveball pretty well. I think that's right where he wanted it to end up. But that was close. We'll see what they go with now after that didn't work out. And we got him. And he struck him out. 97 miles an hour. Ends the inning. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. Now at the plate, We're up by Joel four comes into this in the top of the fifth. In the ball game. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And he throws the fastball by him here. I think we've got, yeah, 64 pitches. We're not going to pitch a complete game, I can tell that much already. Down the middle of the strike zone. Not the greatest of game plans, though. Behind 0 and 2 now. Line drive to center field. Okay, there's a single. One for two in his first couple of plate appearances. So there'll be a man aboard here to start out their half of the fifth. Okay, our energy Trying is at about a third. Left off, Benny Adams from the stretch. Here's the pitch. And he fouls this one off. Okay, I don't think he's going to run on me. Hit the other way out toward right field. Moving under it, Cortez. One down. All right, now let's see if we can get a double play. Digging in now, Russell Thayer. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Hit down the line at first. This is the tough guy right here to hit into a double play. He's fast and he swings from the it's left 0 and side. 2. Out of the box, he's going to get a good break. You might have to try to get the strikeout right here because very rarely are you nice. get this guy to ground into a double play. And he struck it. That's out. the eighth strikeout of the game. His eighth punch out of the ball game. Two down now. Ready for another shot now. Mike. We're averaging ten a game going into this one. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. Into the corner and slice. It's 0 and 2. Ready on 0 and 2. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. And that's in there. Base hit. There we go. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. So let's see. They're going to let us work. Right there, but three fastballs at this level usually turns into a knock. Oh. To short, and that's through for a base hit. Nieve blows through the stop sign headed for home. Okay, well, there's an earned run. Close the gap to three now. Yeah, Dan, he's got to feel pretty good about that. Not only did he have a great hey, A.B. Right first pitch hacking, but he smoked that ball to mix in a ribby knock. Well, he did. So he we may not be pitching ball. much longer he here. He had an idea of the pitch that he was going to get, and boy, he sure turned it loose and buggy whipped that one. The 1-1 one -one is a low changeup that's laid off. Well, I know the last thing he wants to do is load the bases right here. So the pressure okay, is two and two. Right now to get back in the strike zone. The 2-2 two -two pitch. And that should do it. And that's 80 pitches. We may or may not be done. And we are. And we got the win. This team's pitchers are being challenged to ask more of themselves. Okay, so uh, we have a double performance gain on hits per nine innings. All right, we're going to try to improve our relationship with Darren O'Leary. Okay, you know that we're better than just okay ball players. Let's set an example and turn things around. Okay, the season's long, but we have to play or we have to stay hungry and play hard. And we're going to speak with O'Leary again. I have faith in this group. We're a good squad. We just have to find a way to reflect that in the standings. He agrees and says it won't be long until the team's able to turn things around. And we are now friends. And here we are against the Portland Sea Dogs. And the pitch. 
and we are away. Dan Dero, as we take a look at our visiting club as they take the field in this scoreless ball game, they did get the win last Low circle. Time, but it hasn't been the best week for them as they've won just twice in their last six tries. Yeah, Maddie, this is a classic. And a curve that's a little bit out. A bunch of runs last game, and this team is flying high right now. This is a fight at the bat rack. There we go. Inside fastball. Two balls, two strikes. Two and two. Count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on, on the Let's mound go. in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? I think one of the keys. Oh, get that. that. Come on. He can't make the wow. And the recovery is too late as he's able to beat the throw to first. That should be an error. Boy, that's what wheels can do for you, Dero. You can see this right here on this replay. He just simply outruns the white rabbit. He just outruns the baseball. Yeah. Why? Because this is the one. Okay, so this guy can run. Balls, you can hit till your hands bleed, but if you got no wheels, newsflash, you got no wheels. First pitch coming. Here it is. There we go. I took a little bit off that fastball. To the right, it's strike one. The 0-1 on its way. Okay. I tried to pull that one back, but he couldn't do it, and it's 0-2 now. Jansen gets now. his Let's lead go. at first, nobody out. Swing hard liner to left center, and that finds some outfield grass. It's All right, so the next one that gets through the infield, he's likely going to score. First two batters find a sweet spot, barrel up perfectly. These fans have to be excited. Middle of the order coming to the plate now. After those first two ABs, this could be a laser show. Okay, so no runs and no more hits. From the stretch. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. First and second here with nobody out. Ground ball sent back up the middle. There's one. And a good save at first on the offline throw, but they just get one. Okay, that's a fielder's choice. And he threw it away. They got to force it second, and the runner... So that's not a hit. It'll just be scored a fielder's choice. 0-1 oh, the count. And we got one out here. On its way, the 0-1 oh, pitch. Ooh. And here's a foul tip into the catcher's glove. Moves it to 0-2 oh, now. On, right here. Nice. And miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Okay. With that, here's a We're at, at 13 pitches right now. Squad. Dero, what's your take on this team today? Yeah, Maddie, it's going to be interesting how this offense goes about it. Are they going to go after him early? Are they going to sit back and take, hope he doesn't have his secondary stuff, and drive his pitch count up? You have to find ways. Okay, that fastball was on the, field and think you're going to score on the edge. And he popped him up. Ruben. There we go. We got it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. We've played an inning. No score here on the show. Digging in. Okay, still scoreless. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. First pitch. Okay, we got that call. For a cold strike. Swing and a miss. It's 0-2. Started to go almost. But he holds up ball one. That's a great job of holding up right there. You have two strikes on you. You're trying to protect the plate. It's difficult to not get. And there's a strikeout. The Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball. That's our right second for the first out. All right, here's how the visitors are lining up today. And guys, looking at the numbers, although this team won their last game, they did commit two errors, which they are gonna have to clean up. Today. All right, we're gonna, gonna be more effective on the defense. Try to get through the these ball. guys. Let's see who flashes the leather in this one. Skied into straightaway right. Padilla giving chase. All right, there, it's 21 pitches. We're having a decent inning. So that first in inning was Rich terrible. Montes, as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing in one. All right. The wind-up and the 0-2 pitch. High drive deep down the left field line. Pena and that's a foul. And no one will track it down. 
Here comes another 0 2. We got him. And the inning goes away in uncertainty. 25 pitches fashion. over two innings. And, a ball way outside the strike. and still scoreless in the third. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And this is taken outside for ball one. Okay, we're not getting all the calls. We're getting a few of them. Wow. Shot to third and handled for the first out. We uh, completely, completely messed up that pitch, and we got lucky. First delivery to him on the way. The short hit hard. Bannister scoops it up. Oh! He can't quite dig it out. That's an error. So it's a runner at first as a result of the throwing error. And that'll give way to the third baseman, Doug McDonald. Okay, we're keeping an eye on him, but he's not running. For the first strike. I don't know why in the world anybody would want to be an umpire. That manager has given this umpire an earful on a pitch that he thought was a strike. And he's certainly trying to defend his pitcher. He's set. Here's the 0-1. This one's flared okay. to the left center. And that'll get down for a base hit. Throw into third. I hit L2 in circle, so I don't know why he didn't throw it to first. Standing in, Sam Travis. And they're runners at the corners now. This is line to left. Pena has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. Okay, well, we're down by one. Easily. Well, that wasn't your standard sack fly hit. It was hit pretty low and hard, so it wasn't a given they were going to send it. But they did, and they added number to the run column. Roberto Velasquez is in with two away now as he looks at the ball. Okay, there's strike two. Down. Circle change and a beauty. It's 0-2. All right, we want to get this guy out. McDonald is off of first with two away. Fly ball and That'll work. Left. Moving under it, Pena, and that retires the side. So one run, one hit, one error, and a run. Striding forward now is the DH. Tire the side in order, four pitchers or less to one. each. Hey, we're still in the early and we're actually up by two now. By a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. There's one, and that's gone. Indeed. Look at this. Wow. Gone. He uh, hit the top floor of that building. A solo shot here to left. His first home run of the season as it's now a 3-2 ball game. So he completely wrecked that one. Well, when you groove the first pitch a strike, these hitters are going to make you pay. Something Look at this. Mean, this is going right in the window in the on the top anymore. floor. That hurts. They're right into the crowd, at least. Into the box now, Luis Velasco. So we're only up by one now. Zone, but indeed in the strike zone for the first strike. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. All right. 0 and 2. Our confidence isn't terrible. Looking to put him away. Here's the 0-2. Good and strikeout. Going to hit that one with an or the strikeout, and there's one gone. So striding forward now, Ezra Chassin. He flew out in his last at bat. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, oh, it's two home runs. Stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. Well, he won his last start, but he didn't give up any long balls. He's already given up two here, so he's got his work cut out for him if he's going to get the okay. double this one. He's going to have to start keeping the ball in the yard for starters. Stepping in now, Rich Montes. So my ERA is taking a hit right now. No balls and a strike. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Behind 0 and 2 now. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Okay. 
confidence still isn't that bad. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Okay, he's got that one. Sellers waits on it. There's out number two. Without any trouble, and there are two away. Striding into the box, Connie Crump. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And he lays off a pitch here that he probably shouldn't have. 0-1. And that should be good. Nope. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. Okay, he's not going to go for three. Scoring position with two away. That was a great job of driving that ball, extending his arms very well, was able to get it over the right fielder's head. Okay. It off the wall. Without allowing a run. That's one of those solid hits that you don't even feel coming off the bat. That's all I want is just to not allow another run here. Mm. Well, he's got a base open to use right here, and it looks okay. like he might not be afraid to do that by the way he's pitching him. The count now at two and one. Hey, we got two. The set and the two, two and two. Popped up. We've worked our way back. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. The two-two pitch. Got him. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. So it's two runs on three hits, no errors, and a runner. Ready once again. Okay, still tied at three. Two base hits, both singles to this point. Good circle. And it's in for a called strike one. Really starting to pour now, and the forecast is not showing any signs of a break in the weather. Curve just a little out. Player safety, and right now this field is getting sloppy wet, Matt. And I don't know how much more rain this field can take. Outside, okay, I'm losing confidence in my circle. Let's try it again. That'll work. Now a change of locks him up as he looks at strike three called one away. Digging in once again, Sam Travis. He hit a sack fly earlier. Good strike. A little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Well, that rain is really coming down right now. It's raining cats and dogs. You got to make way sure early. You step in a poodle. That's as hard as I've seen it rain all afternoon. Everyone, it's so much harder to concentrate when it rains. Okay, we got that. Alright, he caught that. That's good. Good circle. That could have gone either way, really. That's not an easy pitch to do anything with, right? 96 miles an hour in on the Okay, hands. one and two. Have to be looking for that pitch to be able to do anything with that. Hey, two out. Now here's the pitch. Skied in the air. To and he's got up. that. All you take it, take it. And he'll get there in plenty of time. All right. This one away, and that ends the inning. And we're still in. Still tied at three. Brian Hirsch. First pitch of the at bat on its way. All right. That hit the hit the side of the strike zone. here. It's coming down a little heavier now. We'll see how much longer the umpires can wait. Well, you could say that again, Matt. It's raining cats and dogs out there. Make sure you don't step in a poodle. I think it's time to get the grounds crew out. Hey, that's obviously the game plan against this guy. Buried and in let's see if we now. can he doesn't know if he's coming back in there or going get that. We got him. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses. For the okay, that's our seventh strikeout. 66 pitches. That was a three pitch strikeout. And with the kind of stuff that he has, it's not uncommon for him to absolutely dominate certain guys. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Ball for two from That so looked good to me. Where's it one now? And he falls behind now, 2 0. Oh. That was a non competitive pitch right there, and he finds himself behind 2 0 in this situation. Okay, there we go. Locate something down the zone, get himself back in this count. Into the windup, here's the 2 and 1. We got pitch. that one. Dangerous curve. 2 and 2. Time, but laid off as it drops into the top of the zone. 
And when a guy starts leaving the curveball up, that's there we go. He's beginning to tire a little bit out there. He's got to be able to get on strikeout number pitch, eight. He's going to start getting hurt. Made a miss on the off speed pitch that time. Luis Velasco goes down for the second out here in the bottom half. No balls in one strike. Okay, and this may be the last inning that we pitch here. And that finds the target. So our energy down. is almost gone. Philosophies on it. So Dan, what was your approach in 0-2 counts? My philosophy is this. I, I think the last thing you there want to do. There we go. There's the last the out of the sixth. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. And we are still in. Again, Rich Montes. Oh for two on his line thus far. That's a strike. If a pitcher can inside. hit that, can hit that pitch every time, that's a strike. Wow. Well, knowing the threat this guy poses if he gets on base, I think the next pitch should be a challenge pitch. There we go. You don't want to give guys that can run a free chance to cause havoc out there, especially the leadoff guy. Okay, we've worked our way back. Crush that ball, and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Oh! Did he catch that? He did. All right. What a play there for the first out. And we are done. Skipper out of the dugout, making the slow trek. And Darren O'Leary comes out and to relieve us. He's seen enough of his starter this afternoon. And we end up winning. Win, it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find a way we to get scored it three in the eighth to win. Happy with this performance. A minor leaguer is assigned temporarily to a new role. Okay, they want to get a look at me as a late reliever for a short time. And let's see here. We're gonna be doing everything heart and soul until we get uh, until we get those perks unlocked. So I'll always put the team first. If this will help us win more games, I'll do it. Always looking it to could... fill needs, clubs will explore every way a prospect might be capable of contributing. Yeah, it could benefit the club down the line to have a to have different options of how we might use you. Versatility is a plus. Understood. It could take a few games for you to settle in, of course. Just try it for a couple of weeks. Try to have fun with it. Sure thing. So, I am now a late reliever, and we will likely be doing a couple more games per episode while I am a late reliever. And we are actually getting close to Lightning Rod as well, so... We might do one of those next time. So the new pitching rotation, I am now in the spot of the closer. So uh, it looks like I'll be coming in for the really late innings, uh, probably the ninth inning when we're ahead to close out a game. And my ERA at this point is 1.40. And I have 56 strikeouts on the book as of now. And zero walks allowed. And my whip, which is walks and hits per innings pitched, is 0.78. I am second. And that is going to end it for today's episode. I want to thank everybody for watching. My name is Allstream. That hit that like and subscribe button. And ring the bell for notifications.